Science and innovation hold the key to progress and development of the country in building wealth creation. The week-long exhibition will showcase and celebrate locally innovated products by local manufacturers in the country. In the mobility industry, we already have a lot of innovations which are market ready. We have uh, the buses, they are on the road made in Uganda. We have motorcycles, electric, clean energy made in Uganda. And we have a lot of the value chain already made in Uganda. While touring the science exhibition, Musenero underscored the need for the ministry to develop more research in finding solutions, hindering the growth of local products. We want to spearhead the research and innovation of products and solutions designed specifically first to address Ugandan problems and then roll on into the region. The country now depends on local investors thanks to the development in research and innovation in the country. We are fully capable of working with science. We are fully capable of taking hold of our science, technology and innovation and the collaborations that we build with international partners are indeed the partnerships, not them bringing just to give us and we are not working. So we are working to take hold of the science. The State Minister for ICT, Joyce Nabosa Sebugwao, urges the public to embrace locally made products which now are of quality. Ugandanism are now coming up. Uh, the standards they are making their goods are very good. They have improved a lot and they should come up and support our fellow Ugandans by buying uh, their commodities. Their commodities are good, they have improved a lot. The Ministry of Science, Technology and Innovation will soon organize an investment summit to educate young investors to thrive competitively in the innovation world. Lydia Chomkama, Juma Samba, UBC News.